Hello guys, I want to thank you all for your emails and comments. Um, this is an update uh, since this morning, so I've been uh, watching the Arik and Irene, and he has, well, good good and bad news, because the bad news is that he's, he's releasing some pressure and he has gotten bigger, but the good news is that he's slowing down as well, so he has, he has gradually slowing down from last night to now, which is about uh, 8 o'clock here in UK. And he went from 40 mile per hour, is now at 12 mile per hour. The gust is about under 5 mile. And the maximum wind speed is uh, 85 mile per hour. So, uh, this morning it was on uh, 90, 90 mile per hour winds. And it was a gust of uh, under 20, okay, and the speed was 13 mile per hour. So, it's, it's kind of slowing down, so as he, get, as he gets bigger, the bigger he gets, the more hard will be, more difficult will be for him to move, and he has to give up. So, hopefully, by the time he's getting close to the coast, he, hopefully he disappears, he just basically vanish. But whatever is a lot of water that is carrying with him, that is going to probably cause most of the damage. So... Really, guys, I, this is unpredictable. I can't really tell you the, the correct what's going to happen because nobody can can do anything about it. It's one of those things that just make us humans uh, feel smaller than a mouse because we can control it. It's just it's just how how the mother nature is. Uh, now, if he carries on, then if he lasts for another week, then even as here on Europe, we'll have. We'll have some problems, as you can see, this is the route at the moment. But, like I said, it's so improbable, you can't even change direction at any time. And, you know, so the size of Europe, that's, that's how big it is, is the size of Europe. There it goes. So, subscribe, rate, and leave comments, and I will keep updating you guys. Thanks for watching.